Now we are doing exercise 5.1, question number 7, Roman number 1. Question number 7, Roman number 1. Question is alpha square beta plus alpha beta square. So question says, if alpha and beta are the roots of the equation x square plus px plus q equal to 0 and q doesn't equal to 0, okay? Then find the values of the following in terms of p and q. So solution. What do we know? We know something. It is given here, right? So we given, we know that, what do we know? Alpha plus beta, alpha plus beta is equal to, okay, first let us do something different. Let us start from very basic. So, okay. So comparing, comparing x square plus px plus q equal to 0 with ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0, we have a is equal to 1 b is equal to px and bx so b will be equal to p and c is equal to plus q here and plus c here so c will be equal to q okay so therefore i can write down alpha plus beta that is sum of roots sum of roots which is alpha plus beta is equal to minus b by a right minus b by a which is minus b minus b is p so minus b by a a is 1 so minus p by 1 which is minus p equation number 1 next therefore product of root that is alpha into beta will be equal to c by a that is q by a that is 1 q by 1 it is q Okay, now, so this one, equation number one, so now alpha square beta plus alpha beta square, okay, this one we can write down as take alpha and beta common from both, so alpha beta is taken out common, right, alpha beta taken out common, this is equation number two. Alpha beta taken out common, so what's left out? Alpha plus beta, right? So alpha into beta, I have taken out common from these two. What's left out? Alpha plus beta. Alpha into beta, we know something. Alpha plus beta from equation number one is minus p, so is equal to minus p. And alpha plus beta, we know alpha into beta. Okay, sorry. So alpha into beta is this one, right? Alpha into beta is q, so q into alpha plus beta from equation number one it is minus p right so i can write down minus p q okay which is the answer for this first question okay so that's all now let me do roman number two roman number two is alpha plus one into beta plus one solution so alpha plus 1 so here alpha plus 1 in beta plus 1 so multiply by alpha into beta plus 1 plus 1 into beta plus 1 first you are multiplying by alpha to both and by 1 to both right so the answer will be by alpha you are multiplying to both so alpha into beta it will be alpha beta plus alpha into 1 it is alpha plus 1 into beta it is beta plus 1 into 1 it is 1 so alpha beta plus alpha plus beta plus 1 so what do we know we know that okay we know that alpha plus beta is equal to from previous roman number one we have derived this one 
alpha plus beta is minus p and alpha into beta is q from here you can see here right alpha plus beta here and alpha into beta here so alpha plus beta it is minus p equation number one and alpha into beta is q equation number two okay let me name this as equation number this is one let's say this is two let's say and this is three so substituting equation number two and three in equation number one we have equation number one alpha into beta first alpha into beta is minus alpha into beta it is q so q plus alpha plus beta alpha plus beta it is minus p plus one right so i can write down this one as q minus p plus one right which is the required solution that's all now let us do roman number three roman number three we have one by alpha square one by alpha square plus one by beta square alpha square beta square so solution so alpha square beta square i don't lcm alpha square beta square so if you take the lcm alpha square beta square beta square will multiply here it will be beta square plus alpha square will multiply here alpha square okay so here alpha square plus beta square and alpha square beta square and now what you are going to do is make this one into alpha plus beta how alpha square plus beta square plus 2 alpha beta okay a square plus b square plus twice a b a square plus twice a b plus b square is a plus b whole square okay so i can make into that formula but now alpha square was there beta square was there 2 alpha beta you have taken extra so you remove that one okay you have taken extra so you have to remove you cannot take anything for free divided by alpha square beta square you can add on alpha beta whole square okay so alpha square plus beta square plus 2 alpha beta you can add on as alpha plus beta whole square and 2 alpha beta write down separately 2 alpha beta divided by alpha beta whole square so alpha plus beta okay so we know that we know that alpha plus beta is equal to minus p equation number one and alpha into beta is equal to q equation number two this is equation number three how do we know we know from previous one it's from here sum of roots alpha plus beta it is minus p and products of roots alpha into beta it is q okay from roman number one i have solved there now so let's say this is equation number one so substituting equation number two and three in one we have 2 and 3 in equation number 1 so i can write down this one as alpha plus beta whole square alpha plus beta that is minus p minus p whole square minus 2 alpha beta 2 alpha beta it will be 2 into q 2 into q minus p whole square divided by 2 into uh, minus 2 q divided by alpha beta whole square alpha into beta it is q so q square uh, i think you cannot see clearly so p minus p square it is p square minus 2q divided by q square okay and this is your solution okay now let me do the next question that is roman number four roman number four it is alpha square alpha cube and beta cube alpha cube plus beta cube solution if you know the formula for a plus b whole cube it is a cube plus b cube minus thrice a b plus thrice a b a plus b okay this is the formula for a plus b whole cube 
Now, if you want to find out only for these two, okay, a cube, my a cube plus b cube from here, I'm writing down. What you are going to do is a plus b whole cube in my three a b a plus b transfer this one whole this side. So plus will become minus three a b a plus b. Okay, so this will be the formula for a cube plus b cube. Same thing alpha cube plus beta cube, you can write down as alpha plus beta whole cube a plus b whole cube minus thrice a b that is thrice alpha beta a plus b that is alpha plus beta right now so now we know we know that what do we know we know alpha plus beta is equal to p minus p and alpha into beta is equal to q okay so therefore alpha plus beta whole cube minus thrice alpha beta alpha plus beta will be equal to this one alpha plus beta whole cube alpha plus beta it is minus p whole cube minus 3 alpha beta it is q and alpha plus beta it is minus p again minus p whole cube it will be minus into minus minus into minus into minus minus into minus plus plus into minus minus so first write down minus p cube minus into minus it is plus 3 p q okay and i hope this is your answer let me do the next question that is roman number five Roman number five, x square here. So Roman number five, the question is alpha square by beta plus beta square by alpha plus beta square by alpha. Solution. So what you are going to do here, take the LCM alpha beta, alpha will go here and it will be alpha cube plus beta will go and multiply here beta into beta square it will be beta cube okay so i don't have space here so let me write down here alpha cube plus beta cube like previous one i have explained to you alpha cube plus beta cube it i have written down as alpha plus beta whole cube minus three alpha beta alpha plus beta so write down alpha plus beta whole cube alpha plus beta whole cube minus three alpha beta alpha plus beta divided by alpha into beta right so we also we know that we know that what do we know we know alpha plus beta is equal to minus p from equation this is equation number one and alpha into beta is equal to q how do we know this one i have, let me tell you once again in first we have derived this one you can derive this one again okay you can write down this one again okay but it's same thing alpha plus beta we got minus p and product of the roots alpha into beta we got q okay from here i'm writing down again so this is equation number two and let me say this is equation number three so substituting 1 and 2 in 3 okay. we have so equation 1 and 2 I'm putting here in equation number 3 so alpha plus beta whole cube it will become minus P whole cube minus 3 alpha beta alpha into beta it is Q so 3 alpha beta it will be 3 Q alpha plus beta it is minus p again so write down minus p divided by alpha beta so alpha into beta it is q so q which is equal to minus p whole cube it is minus p cube minus into minus it is plus 3 p q divided by q okay and i hope this is the answer that's all now let me do the last question that is roman number six roman number six Roman number 6, it is alpha square plus bit 2, alpha square plus 2, and beta square plus 2. 
solution what can i do here let me multiply so alpha square into beta square plus 2 by alpha square i'm multiplying to both plus 2 beta square plus 2 next i'm multiplying by 2 to both so this one i can write down as let me write down here i don't have sufficient space so let me write down here alpha square into beta square it will be alpha square beta square alpha square into 2 it will be plus 2 alpha square plus 2 into beta square it will be 2 beta square plus 2 into 2 it will be 2 to the 4 alpha into beta square alpha square into 2 2 into beta square and 2 into 2 so now okay so i can write down this one alpha square beta square i can write down as alpha beta whole square plus 2 if i take common so it will be 2 alpha square plus beta square plus 4 okay now i can write down further this one alpha into beta square so alpha beta square fine plus 2 okay alpha square plus beta square i don't have anything i need to make alpha plus beta so like i have done in roman number three i think so i can write down alpha square plus beta square plus two alpha beta a square plus b square plus twice a b but i have already told you i cannot do this for free minus plus two alpha beta is taken extra so remove this one if if you have taken then you have to remove also nothing is free in mathematics okay so alpha into beta write down alpha beta whole square plus 2 alpha square plus beta square plus 2 alpha beta this still here i can write down as 2 alpha plus beta whole square right minus so minus 2 alpha beta 2 is taken out common right so you have to multiply by 2 to this one also so 2 to the 4 so minus 2 to the 4 alpha beta is okay and plus 4 now so and we know so we know what do we know we know we know alpha beta is equal to q and alpha plus beta is equal to minus p okay so alpha beta you write down alpha into beta it is q so q square plus 2 alpha plus beta 2 into alpha plus beta alpha plus beta it is minus p whole square minus 4 into alpha beta so 4 into alpha beta that is q plus 4 okay alpha beta square that is q square 2 2 alpha plus beta minus p 4 minus 4 into alpha beta minus 4 into alpha into beta it is q plus 4 so this one i can add on as q square plus into my uh, plus 2 minus p square it will be p square so 2 p square minus 4 q plus 4 okay so i can arrange this one 2 p square i can keep in front and i can write down also so I can let me write down 2p square plus q square minus 4q plus 4. Okay, so which is the required answer? I hope you understood everything. Okay, that's all. Thank you so much. We will meet in the next video.